Hello everybody, this is Sauce Tutorials. Today we'll be doing a quick tutorial here guide on how to add text and also images as well to your backgrounds for you know, when you're recording apps and games such as this, Final Fantasy Brave Exvius or Brave Frontier or any other video, even if you take video with your phone, forget to rotate it to landscape. Uh, if you're just taking portrait mode, it'll look like this, where it only takes about a third of the screen and it looks really bad on YouTube videos or just like showing on someone else's TV or computer, it just looks bad. So you can spice it up a little bit by adding images and text on the side. Uh, this is obviously for Mac users with iMac. Uh, it won't be in backgrounds. Go in title here. You think you'd be able to do this. I mean, you can. Uh, this is pretty basic. Like, let's do this. Um, you can do whatever you want, like for this video, it's a tutorial, so I'll just do tips, blah, 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 and I guess I could go, it's really sloppy, one's over here, oh yeah, it's just annoying. Anyway, so it's a little bit customizable, you can make it bigger, smaller, obviously you don't want to do that, because then it'll be in front of the image, bold, whatever, and change the color change the font, but it's pretty much it. You can't move this box anywhere. It's pretty much stuck right there. You can't, it's really irritating. So it's very restrictive. So we'll go and delete that. What you want to do is get a image editor. I use Pixelmator. That's 30 bucks in the Mac App Store. I got it for 15 on sale. You can use GIMP or anything other free or whatever you want to do. Basically, you just make a new image. I do 1080p video, so it's 1920 by 1080. And then you want to make two text boxes over here. So we got one over here and then one over there. Just be mindful of this middle area. If you do need to resave it, or if it's two, if it overlaps your video, you just make it smaller, whatever. But it's obviously much better here. We can do, we can take up however as much space we want. <clears throat> uh, another nice thing about this is you can add images also. It's easy, just go to Finder, drag something down above or below your text. Okay, and then once you are ready to go, whatever you want in there, go ahead and so BG here, just drag it down here. And you'll probably want this for your whole video. If not, you can just do segments, uh, whatever. Go ahead and drag this down for however long you want the video. Um, but obviously that's not going to work, so we have to make some changes here. Uh, first thing, let's go to the cropper. Um, Ken's burns, it's annoying, it goes in and out like it was doing earlier. Just do fit, click on it again. The way it doesn't move around, it's really irritating. So we have that, and then we'll go to this, uh, for the left one, video overlay settings. I we'll want to change this from cutaway to picture in picture. And that's obviously not going to work. So if we do this, it's going to overwrite what we already have. So go here, dissolve, go to swap. And then basically you have your main video here. And you just stretch it out. And it's as easy as that. So this is obviously too much here. So I just have to go back, drag it over a little bit, and then save it, put it back over there. Um, but that's pretty much it. Um, this obviously same thing. You would just grab a picture, drag it down here. Obviously, kind of pointless doing that. So it's a picture of itself, and then you put it in here. Um, but yeah, that's really simple. It took me a while to figure this out. Uh, it's not super straightforward here in iMovie, so um, this is helpful to you. And I'll go ahead and leave a comment below if you have any other questions on how to do this or maybe you have your own tips and tricks on some better way to do this. I found this is pretty easy and it works for me. Uh, but that's pretty much it for this video for background text and pictures as well. For vertical apps, movies, whatever. Uh, but thank you for watching and see you in my next video.